In today's business world, more and more employees are working remotely from home. The question is, is your organization prepared to support those employees working remotely? When we take a look at employees and what they need to do their job, it's more than just online meetings and email. It's a number of different things, everything from documents, files, forms, business processes, let alone news and communications, which need is needed to bring them closer back into the organization. So the question is, how can your organization change to support these remote employees, especially when much of the information is all over the place just by the nature of how your organization grew organically, which can be very frustrating for employees and, and lead to impacts on productivity. If you have Office 365, you have a solution. You can leverage SharePoint and Teams to actually provide a digital workplace where employees can access, through a common user experience, organization information, news, announcements, communicate with other employees, find employees through an employee directory. You can also set up employee self-service portals, such as Doc Central, a place that they can go find policies, procedures, and other documents that they need in their everyday work. You can also set up Process Central, which is a business process portal that allows them to do things such as expense reports, travel requests, and other forms that may be manual now that you can actually put online and automate the processes. Put in place a knowledge base, and you can also put in place a central service request system so they don't spend their time calling and playing email tag with different service departments such as IT, HR, marketing, and other departments that they interact with. And then finally, for those departments, you can also set up portals that allow them to organize things within Teams, within SharePoint, and also provide a self-service capability to their customers across the organization in an employee portal. This is all possible with Office 365, SharePoint, and Teams. And with SP Marketplace, what we've done is created SP Self-Service Hub. This is an out-of-the-box solution leveraging Office 365, SharePoint, and Teams to provide your employees with a empowering, productive solution today. Let's take a look at what the employee experience through the eyes of an actual employee. Donna Martin, who's in the finance department at Radiant Solar, but working from home. Donna can access her window into the organization through Office 365. And she can do that through SharePoint by just hitting the home icon anywhere in Office 365. Or if she prefers, she can do it through her Teams interface. Best of all, it doesn't matter whether she's in her office at home working on a laptop or somewhere else working through a tablet or phone. The SP Self-Service Hub supports any device. The system immediately recognizes Donna and presents the window to the organization through their enlightened Radiant Solar homepage. Through this page, Donna can immediately see alert information such as the new COVID-19 guidelines, company announcements. She can also see any company events that she may need to add just by clicking on it to her calendar. Also, there's company news, and it could be news from her industry, and there's internal news. There's also news from different departments, and she can also participate in conversations with her fellow employees, see the latest tweets, and any employee recognition. So coming in, this is a great way that the first thing in the morning, she can see what's going on in the company. The other thing she really likes about it is that it's designed so that in one or two clicks, she can get to 80 or 90 percent of the things she needs to do her job. If she needs to talk to an employee, she can just click on Employee Directory, where she's presented with a list of employees, and she can always go up and search for a specific employee she needs to talk with, such as Tom Franz. To talk with Tom, all she has to do is hover over Tom's name, and she can chat with him, send him an email, even see different interactions she's had with him right from her self-service hub. The company's also placed relevant links such as we saw with the wellness program sign up for her to click on. 
So she could go in and see the organization chart, go to the company website, see a time off calendar, or other things the company wants her to see. And these actually are specifically targeted towards her and expire, such as this wellness program, after they're not relevant anymore. Now, the nice thing, too, is that she has a my links so that when she comes in if she needs to get to her email her calendar or to maybe her team or a specific application she can do that and she picked out those links when she first came on to the system through quick links she can find directions to their offices or locations are frequently asked questions local links which actually is related to her location for transportation restaurants those type of things and different reference links that may be relevant uh, to her for her job Additionally, she can also go in and start using the employee self-service or employee central features, such as perhaps she needs to find a document. She can go to Document Central, where she can go in and find, without having to worry about what department it's in or looking for it through uh, a file server, she can look for the latest policies or forms that she needs, or she could actually search across the entire organization. So if she wanted to browse or find, for instance, the latest drug testing policy, all she has to do is type in drug, and it presents her with the latest employee handbook and this, and she can click on this and see uh, a view of that. Perhaps she wants something more specific, like she's working on a, a very tough spreadsheet, and she needs to find the latest Excel quick reference, and it will bring up the document she's looking for, and she can even, again, read those or even download those from here without having to worry about which department do I get this from. And it automatically has governance built in, so she doesn't get to the things she's not supposed to. So much better than signing in, in through VPN and then going through the very complex file server to find her documents. Next, Donna, just remember that she needs to ask for time off over Thanksgiving holiday. So let's go take a look at Process Central. So Process Central is much nicer to go to because she can get to any business process that is an employee facing business process in one place. She doesn't have to worry about that she has the right um, favorite in her browser or think if she has a link on her Windows front page. Uh, it's all right here. And so if she needs to get her paycheck, uh, last stub, or other things like requesting time off, she can just click right here and it's built into the system. There's also a business forms uh, capability in Process Central where she can actually get to forms that typically are a, a manual process such as a timesheet or a purchase request or a travel request and download those and be able to submit them right here and there it will take it through an approval process. So again, one click away from the home page is any business process. Finally, if Donna needs help from a different department, say IT, facilities, HR, has questions, she doesn't have to just send an email or try to play phone tag with them. She can actually go to Help Central, and from there, she can submit a service request to any department in the organization and keep track of the status of those if she needs help from somebody, you can actually she actually has the ability to directly contact, uh, say, the HR person. And also there's a knowledge base, which is an organization knowledge base that may actually answer her question after she's done with kind of her administrative things she needs to get done in the organization. She can actually proceed on to the finance staff portal, of which she is a staff member of, and be able to work on different things, be able to see staff announcements, news, um, interact with the staff, and even go to a My Workspace where she can actually see tasks assigned to her, most recent documents that she's worked on, and so on. Department Portals is part of the SP Marketplace Digital Workplace integrated portal structure, which provides an out-of-the-box place for the organizations such as finance, IT, other departments work together to share information, work on projects together, and organize the overall department. And best of all, Donna can choose whether she wants to work in the finance department through Teams or through a SharePoint interface. And it's all integrated with the self-service hub. So empower your employees with self-service, leveraging Office 365 with SP Self-Service Hub. It's part of the SP Workplace Solutions, which transform Office 365 into a digital workplace, leveraging SharePoint and Teams. 
Learn more at spmarketplace.com.